Hello everyone, it's Millie. So today it is the 25th of December, which means it's Christmas Day, so Merry Christmas, first of all. And that also means I'm being really organised by filming this video, by filming it on time. Though I probably am going to end up uploading this on like the 20th of January. I tried. Okay, today's video is a what I got for Christmas video. Hopefully you enjoy, and if you do, subscribe. <laughs> So I thought now would be a good time to plug my merch <laughs> because if you've got any Christmas money that you don't know what to do with and you're like, you know what, maybe I kind of want some really tea merch, head to the description and grab your merch. I do this merch design in hoodies and t-shirts and also pop sockets. This style has rose gold writing on the back or you can pick up a white and metallic silver jumper which is really, really cool. Take a look if you're bored and want to browse whilst listening to this video. First thing I want to show is this Yankee Candle. I got this off my dad. I've never actually owned a Yankee Candle. When I thought I was a YouTube beauty guru in like 2012, I had about 12,000 candles in my room. You can watch my night routine videos if you want proof of that. I literally had like 50. But out of all those candles, I never actually owned a Yankee Candle. But this one is candy cane flavoured and it is so nice smelling. It's really minty. I don't know what it smelled like whilst it was burning though, so I'm kind of excited to try out. That'll be really interesting. My mum got me this Elemis travel kit, beauty travel kit. So it's got some cleansing water, cream, cleanser, shower cream, makeup remover and body oil and it's really good this stuff. My mum lives by it and she was like, you know what, I want you to have some of your own and I was like, okay. So yeah, and this is great because it's travel size as well which means I can take it abroad with me and it won't take up much room in my case because I do tend to travel quite a bit or a lot actually, a lot. The sweets that I get every single year are Maltesers. I've got this box of Maltesers from my mum and then my dad got me a box of Maltesers which was like the king size version. If you like Maltesers or you go food shopping a lot, you know which ones I'm talking about. I'm going to miss out a lot of the food that I got because if I showed you all the food that I got given from my family, the video will be about half an hour long because my family know how much I like food. But I thought these were worth mentioning. Jelly Belly Jelly Beans, these are so good. The flavours are just so nice. However, the Bean Boozled Challenge has low-key put me off these. My cousin bought me this candle and it smells so good. It's from Nex, which is like kind of a clothing slash home decor shop in the UK. And it is so good. This candle smells really nice. Next are like top of the game in terms of candle scents. The scent is so strong. It's lemon and bergamot scented candle. It's so good. So good. This next thing, the box is slightly destroyed because my niece decided it would be a good idea to chew on it. Anyway, you can watch my vlog if you want to see my niece. And I basically vlogged Christmas Day as well. So if you do want to see that, head over to my vlog channel. Anyway, this is a blonde instant blush blonde beautifier Basically, it's a hair spray that makes your hair even blonde if you have blonde hair Or you can get a purple version which is literally purple and that is if your hair is silver I'm actually planning on getting my hair grey or silver in the future and I'm excited I also got earrings two reasons why I always need earrings one because I lose everything and two because I have about 20 piercings in my ears So I always need quite a few earrings to make up for that to cover each hole I also got some more perfume and this one is revealed by Calvin Klein. I've never actually tried a Calvin Klein perfume before, so it will be interesting. But I have smelled it and it smells really, really good. From my auntie, I got this suede look travel slash toiletry bag. And inside, I have this earring tray in a bag, which is going to come in very useful. Because as I said before, I go through earrings way too fast and constantly lose them because I am very unreliable. I also got the Morphe Times Jaclyn Hill palette collaboration and I actually borrowed this from Lewis in Paris and I was like, you know what, this is really good, I want it for myself. So um, yeah, I got it for Christmas and these are the colours in it, it's absolutely gorgeous and it has all my red, burgundy, orange, sunset kind of shades I am absolutely in love with if you can't tell from my eye look today, which is probably very messed up by now because it's about 10 o'clock at night. Okay, I'm gonna do this one now, the one you may have been waiting for because no doubt I use this one for clickbait in the thumbnail, of course. <laughs> the Louis Vuitton gift. So this is my main gift from my mum and I was just so happy with this. It completely came as a shock because originally I was gonna ask for my entire family, I have a lot of people in my family, to put a bit of money towards getting me a Louis Vuitton bag and that wouldn't work out that much between them all because I literally have like over 100 people in my family. There's a lot of people, but then my mum was like, you know what, I'm just gonna get it for you. Um, and there's reasons for that that I don't really wanna talk about in this video, but I'll probably talk about in my strip down challenge, which is gonna be coming out after I hit a million subscribers, if I do. Just a lot of personal things I'm gonna kinda get off my chest in that video so you guys can get to know me more and feel like you really know me. There's a reason behind her spending so much money and I'm also extremely grateful. And this bag is literally out of stock everywhere, so I have no idea 
idea how this managed to come into stock. My mum went to the Manchester Selfridges and they found it in the stock room and they thought it was an error because they were like, this must be sold out, it's sold out everywhere. But no, it was just hiding in the stock room and it's my little mini Palm Springs Louis Vuitton backpack. And this one is just, oh, the quality of the Louis Vuitton bags is just absolutely impeccable. Like the just feel of the bags is just such good quality. And this is a mini backpack, which means it'd be good for when I go out at nights and stuff. But it also has enough room to fit my purse, chewing gum, phone and camera, which are like the main things that I always take out with me. So I am extremely, extremely suited with this. I am so in love with it. So in love with it. Also worth mentioning that I did treat my mum back this Christmas as well, so it wasn't a one-way thing with her getting me this bag. If you are enjoying this video as you are watching, please stick around by pressing that subscribe button. We've got more videos like this. Actually, there's no more videos like this coming for another year, but subscribe anyway. Okay, I don't want to feel like too much of a cringy white girl who feels the need to name every single thing that she owns. Like, what should I call this shampoo bottle? But, um, what should I call this bag? See, I'm stuck between a name like, oh, Lucy or Florissa. And for it to be like a really feminine girl or whether for it to be like a man and be like, Dexter. I kind of feel Dexter, I think. Do we feel Dexter? What should I call her, him? It. Let's not assume. <laughs> Something else I got that I do want to show is this light bulb made into a glass i think harm is going to be really jealous because i'm kind of stealing his brand with this but my stepdad got it for me he was like, i don't know why i got it i just thought of you when i saw it and i was like thanks but yeah it's got diet coke in it if you expected juice or water you were very wrong because uh, like water and diet coke i live off and yeah so this I got off my stepdad and it's a Marc Jacobs kit. I have a Marc Jacobs perfume here and then here is a body lotion and shower cream. The perfume is absolutely massive. It's 100 milliliters, which is so much. And it also, the perfume is so big that it's its own bag. It comes with a massive chain attached to it so you can literally wear it as a shoulder bag. Interesting. Very interesting. Next thing I'm gonna unpackage alive because I just came home like half an hour ago and realized that there were two presents still under the tree and it's from my auntie and cousins. So yeah, here we go, live unboxing what I got for Christmas. <laughs> so yeah, Georgia, if you're watching this, thank you in advance. French Connection date night. Ooh, that is so perfect, oh my God. Right, first of all, that bike is absolutely gorgeous. Again, good for travel. It's literally got my most valued makeup products in here. An eyeliner, which I absolutely love because I've got, like, got it on my waterline now. It's got a lip gloss in here. I love my kind of pinky coloured lip glosses, as you can tell now. And then it's also, I think this is an eyeshadow palette, is it? Oh, yes. With very uh, neutral kind of everyday colours, which I like a lot. That would actually be really good for the summertime as well. This is the next one. Oh, sister bag. It's like the textured silver material and likewise with the small bag. Let's see what's inside. Body lotion. I really like that packaging as well. It's so simple. If my room was tidy, I'd definitely put these up for decor. I will do once I tidy my room, which will be probably in about a month. Okay, the thing is, I feel like I tidy my room like every single day, but then within the next day, it just gets messy again. And I don't know how, because I swear all I do is sleep in my room. Body wash in the same packaging, love it. And body spray. They look so good together. Oh my god, I ship. <laughs> I also got another perfume, which I'm definitely not complaining about. I can never have enough perfume. I go through perfumes so fast because I take perfume everywhere with me. This is Hugo Boss. I haven't smelled this one, actually. It's a pink colour, though, which is really nice. I'm into it. That's such a good song. Oh, wow, that smells really nice. These pillows don't make my set look nice. I swear to God, would you stand up? At least that's straight. Okay, next thing, I got some lounging pyjamas, which I absolutely love. They are long leg as well, perfect for the winter. And with that, I also got a dressing gown, which I think is in one of the other bags, but the dressing gown is pink. It's so soft and so lovely. And I also got some slippers as well. So basically, I am all kitted up for my winter pyjama nightwear stuff. Here it is. It's so soft. It's really, really soft. I'm going to put it on now, actually. That feel real good on the skin. The pink and black go really well together as well. And uh, link in the description. Whoopsie. Teehee. I always either sleep in shorts and like a vest top or naked. So wearing actual pajama pants is going to be a challenge. But you know what? I'm going to I'm gonna try it. New year, new me, you know. 2018, here I come. Looks like you need to stop doing that. Some royal jelly with pure honey hand cream in all different kinds of scents and flavours. You might be watching this video thinking, but Millie, this isn't a real what I got for Christmas because one thing's missing, and that is the Lynx Africa set. 
<laughs> but yes, I got it. So now this is officially a what I got for Christmas video. Link's a track set, sorry, but this is really nice. I never complain about this. I go through these so fast as well, the Link's deodorants. Okay, more perfume. This time is Vera Wang Princess. I've heard of Vera Wang perfume so much, but I have no idea why. I feel like this is going to be a big staple to my perfume collection. My grandma also got me as one of my presents hair chalk and it's like this blue hair chalk and I'm like you know what for my day-to-day -day life I don't really fancy making my hair blue but for a video or if I'm feeling edgy one day I might do it because it's got the blue chalk there and you like straighten your hair with it for a second there I thought the plastic layer had come off and my hair was going to be blue that would be terrifying yeah hopefully you enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video bye guys Mwah.